Here are nine commands that you're going to want to put in your auto exec as fast as you can. I'll make sure to leave everything in the description below so all you have to do is copy it, paste it in your auto exec and choose the key you want to bind. Let's get started. Our first command is going to be a simple jump throw bind. This lets you throw utility consistently while jumping. This is a simple smoke wall for nuke. For this, you need a jump throw bind. The second command is going to be a running jump throw bind. This does the same thing as the first, except a little bit further. This is a regular jump throw, and this is a running jump throw. Our third command is going to be a bind for quick switching. I know a lot of people like to use this when they play the op. The next one is going to be for dropping the bomb at the push of a button. The fifth command is going to be for dropping util at the push of a button. This next one is going to be for toggling the zoom of your radar like so. This is really helpful when trying to navigate inside of smokes. So let's say there's a smoke down right here and you want to get into the vent. So you get inside the smoke, you toggle the radar, you find the vent, you go downstairs, and that's it. This next command is going to be for toggling the volume. This lets you better hear the opponents and what's going on on the map. I like to bind this to shift because that way if I'm walking it's always on so I can better hear and also if I'm standing in a corner waiting for somebody listening I can hold it easily I'll try and make some noise here and toggle the command try and see if you can hear the difference The second to last command is going to be for refunding everything at the push of a button. So let's say you just bought a full kit here and then your team decides actually let's save this round. You can just refund everything at the push of a button. The final command is going to be for a crouch jump. This basically binds your jumping action and your crouching action to the same button. This makes it a lot easier to do jumps like this just very consistently. You cannot fail these with this bind. It also makes it easier to do stuff like this. That's going to do it for this one, guys, but I post a lot of similar content, so please like, comment, and subscribe below so you don't miss out on the next one. I'll see you all there.